the glorious trek that is this game. I use glorious somewhat loosely. Yes, terrorists. That's exactly what it is. Y'all are bad at that. Just keep moving as nobody moves anywhere. It's a sweet Bahamut fight going on over there. There was a sweet Bahamut fight, and I appear to have missed something exploding. Hooray! Can I get around you? Probably not. Maybe. Worst response times I think I've ever seen. Pardon me, coming through. Probably should get experience, but I'm lazy. Won't you even dare. I guess we go this way. The most logical path is to jump over here, obviously. That's exactly what I would think when I came across that, across that situation. I need to somehow... Oh, okay. It's quite the jump. I thought we had to, you know... I guess that's the next level. Whatever. Don't question the almighty game. There's a, there's a turtle. A turtle! There's two turtles. I don't know where the turtles are going. They're twirling. That one appears to be just wandering around. All right, whatever. The turtles aren't very smart. As it turns out, there's a behemoth. And a bunch of dudes. There's a bunch of three-way fights out here. It looks like. I don't really want to do anything with any of them, but I'm probably going to have to end up fighting something at some point here. No Huggles! You're a giant turtle, I know, but no Huggles. There's an item there. It's also a giant turtle, but there's an item there. I'm probably going to have to fight those dudes to get their item, I'm sure. 15,000 gil. Hi, turtle. Bye, turtle. Can I have your item? Aha, uh -huh, I can! Perfect conductors. And there's what appears to be stairs down. Okay. Let's take a casual stroll down the stairs that are surprisingly still perfectly intact, despite being made of basically tissue. Did they kill the behemoth, or is it just laying down? Well, that's the way we have to go. Look out. You look out, woman. I don't know what I'm looking out for. Probably that proto-behemoth that's just chillaxing there, but... Well done on his part. Managed to do a whole lot of nothing. Hello, let me in! Apparently we can open this door. friend there's a save point and a whole lot of nothing between us and the save point so literally a whole lot of nothing it's a whole lot of people just standing around as the city basically explodes but apparently nobody cares well don't spread out you idiot hmm I don't really know what's going on here. I don't know which way to go. And I'll also be right back. Yay. We've returned! To... No idea where I'm going, man. There's a lot of dude things everywhere. None of these dude things I wish to fight. There's an item, though. I do like dude mans.
two blaze rings. I should be doing all these fights just for the experience, but as mentioned, if I need experience, I can do fights on my own and not waste everyone's time, because it's not like the fights are exactly entertaining, to say the least. You, sir, are standing. Now you're looking at me. Pretty much all you're doing, just standing there. I have no idea where I'm going. Apparently up there. Okay. How does one get there? I don't know. Pardon me. Huggles and stuff. I'm probably missing a few items as well. I don't... If I see an item, I grab it. I don't see any items, though. I do see a giant pit of doom over here. Frame rate lag. Don't even... Thank you. What is going on over here? They are. Thank you, Hope. Yes. They are fighting, as it turns out. Is there anything over here? Just out of curiosity. Just some dude mans that want to kill me? Yep, so just some dude mans that want to kill me. Well. We could probably get around them. That's a boss from the beginning of the game, isn't it? Or something very similar to a boss from the beginning of the game. Thankfully we can ambush them, thus making it drastically easier, but you know. Who do we kill first? The Tyrant or the Vernal Harvester? I think they just staggered the... I think they hit the Vernal Harvester, but whatever. Let's hit this thing! And let the sword and the other thing duke it out, I guess. Why not? Looks like we should be able to get rid of this thing in one... One Delia. One Stagger, is what I was going for there. The only downside is that thing. Who very nearly just one shot Hope. We should probably heal him. To be to be quite honest, we should Yeah, we probably should have healed him. Let's heal him now. Oh, challenging actually boosts the um nice evade there. Boost the stagger gauge. Would you like to heal him eventually? Thank you. Ty. Quit wasting my time. I thought he was gonna attack a little bit faster than that. There he is. Did he just miss, or was that flip just for show? Or did he just entirely miss everyone? No, launch him. Thank you. Don't hit him with ruin, just launch him in the air. Thank you. That is your sole purpose, is keeping it airborne. And hitting it in the face and doing damage, but mostly keeping it airborne. So it doesn't hurt anyone else. 7,000 CP, which probably wouldn't even get me a single orb, or node, or whatever they're called now. A single crystal? I don't know. Some background noise going on in the game here. And in real life. We'll find another way in. There's no time for that! What did you do? You dangus. You summoned the, the street racing group. I don't know what's going on. It sounds like Final Fantasy X-2 music. Hero. Pretty lame. 
Hey, a snow? Hey! <laughs> Where you been? <laughs> Guys! Hello! So, snow. You're a pulseless sea now, huh? Indeed. We're being huggles. Yeah. Good times. Then why didn't you tell us? Why the hell didn't you come and find us? <sighs> yeah, we've been waiting. Us and the rest of the Purge fugitives. <laughs> <laughs> but damn, those Pulse Falci sure know how to pick them. Yeah, out of all the idiots in the world, they choose this one. Oh, hey, hey, now wait just a minute here. <laughs> I am your fearless leader. You're not supposed to laugh at the boss. What? Whoa. That's quite the group of people we have now. Just like old times, huh, boss? Don't you worry. We'll take care of the civilians. And you concentrate on saving Cocoon. We all will, together. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Hope. <laughs> now, what's our motto? I'll see you no match for Nora! Well done, Hope. Made it all awkward there, didn't you, buddy? Overly dramatic music. Underly dramatic music. Underly? It's not even a word, but we'll roll with it. Wherever the game wants to continue, there we go. More civilians. Hello, civilians. You have treasure. A treasure box. A treasure a treasure sphere. And it has weapons that I won't use. <laughs> Yay! So much treasure chest wasted on weapons that I'll never use. Should probably save. We've gone quite a ways without saving. Admittedly, we hadn't fought anything along the way, really, but we've gone quite a ways. What's going on here? I'm sure you can, Hope. Is there something over there? Nope. Some behemoths, though. Hello, behemoth. Goodbye, behemoth. It's also a juggernaut over here. Two! Two of the freaking things. Hmm. I wonder how hard these are. Presumably fairly hard. I also wonder if that behemoth is working with them. Who knows? I thought he was gonna... Oh, he is gonna turn around. Sir, you appear to have a very weird anchor on your butt there. Robotic butt anchor. Hi, you want to turn around so I can hunt you? Although I'm not a robot with red eyes, but details. No, seriously, can you turn around? Oh, he insta spots you anyway. Well, I oh, just ran into the very tip of his hand and couldn't squeeze by. Well, screw you, game. This is probably going to be one of those fights, isn't it? gonna be one of them fights. Have I libered these things? No, because I ran away from them last time. I don't imagine this time's gonna go any better, is it? Don't, don't imagine it will. It's gonna hurt. Yep. Don't worry. She is. And he's gonna steam clean. Of course he is. What do we know? Has a billion hit points, just like it did before. It's not weak to anything, just like it was before. The only difference is now we do more damage. I 
And I'm hopefully going to be able to keep it constantly steam cleaning itself, but I don't think I will. It's actually vulnerable to quite a lot of stuff, which would be great if it didn't steam clean it all the way. Because that's how that works, obviously. Because we can kill this thing in one stagger if it didn't steam clean everything. But it does. There it goes. So... Back to murdering it. I'll try to get it staggered with the debuffs up. But I don't know if we'll be able to, actually. I like how slowly it removes everything as well. Did he just miss everyone's fire like half the time there? Oh no, we have protect and stuff up now. Never mind. There's the stagger too. Perfect. And interestingly, you can actually launch these. I forgot about that. Honestly, light will do better than hope. No, she won't. Almost entirely due to the fact that Hope has a thousand magic and lightning does not. There is a reason I have this group of people, and it's because this group of people is the powerful people in my party. He had a particle accelerator in his pocket. His mechanical pocket. Or wherever you keep particle accelerators, I just assume you keep them in pockets. I keep them in pockets. This behemoth just left at me. And then proceeded to instantly ignore me because I've walked like two feet bit past them. I can't be bothered to turn back around. Everything's glowy! Magic. <laughs> Very oh, loud magic. A crystal? I don't like this. Is cocoon falling apart already? Could be. Maybe orphans having trouble holding things together with all this fighting going on. The clamor of this conflict rouses the maid. Suddenly face. <laughs> yeah? Well, we're gonna stop this ruckus soon enough. Can you halt the cavalry's charge? Filled with righteousness, they will slaughter Orphan in the name of freedom. Yay, Orphan. Your only recourse will be to deliver them death, swift and certain. No. Unlike you, they'll listen to reason. <laughs> We will see about that. I shall savor the demise of Cocoon from atop the highest seat in all of Eden. You too should hurry along to the heart of our grand capital. Your loved ones miss you so. Come, let's see. Fulfill your destiny. Your destiny. We'll decide our own destiny. Our destiny has cupcakes. Over Bartandalus's dead body. Bartandalus's well cooked cupcakes. I don't think the game understands my thought processes. I don't care about this dude, man. I just want cupcakes. And we will utilize this save point. So made quite a lot of progress here, mostly skipping the entire, pretty much the entire chapter here. Skip them fights, yo! Skip them fights. I like how the name of the chapter actually changes as you go. Oh, hi.
I don't know what's over there. There's a very angry giant turtle right there. Being a very angry giant turtle. Is there anything behind him? There does not appear to be. There's items there. I don't really know what this thing's doing. Is it just walking around out here? Enjoying its day? Is there anything over here? Oh, you can't even go over there. Exploded though. Oh, don't rotate towards me, man. I must kill him to get that item. Well, Aww. I guess you could just, you know, run in there fast enough and you could probably get both of those. Turtle's not very smart. You very, very silly turtle. And he took that item with him. We got one of them, and I believe we actually got the important of the two, unless you count... I think it's another, like, Moogle puppet or something you can get there. Please don't attack me. Thank you. I just want your loot, yo. Twelve hellish talons. Is there one on the other side? There is. Pardon me, coming through. Don't mind me. I said don't mind me, not charge at me. That's not how this works. And I wasn't even paying attention to what that was, but whatever, yo. Oh wait, I can't go through there. Dude, that's not how these work. You need to work slightly to the left, like this, see? It's a very simple process. They run faster than me, thankfully they're retarded. They don't understand slight angles. Nothing in this game understands slight angles. It makes avoiding things relatively easy. I like these doors. These doors are sweet. They're also overly extravagant, but they're pretty freaking sweet. The special forces. Hello. You were extravagantly dressed. Extravagantly dressed indeed. The throne of Eden has a save point. Which we may as well use, because I've pretty certain there's a horrible, horrible boss fight at some point soon here. Be a lot more willing to save, save more often if it didn't take four hours to load the stupid saves. We don't have much CP. I don't think that's going to do us any good. And our equipment's set up already anyway, I'm pretty sure. There's an item here, though. I like the floor. Look at the floor, man. Kind of cool. <laughs> and those pulse let's see that are running past us. What is that? Mistilton tin? I'm just curious what that does. Ally KO power surge. So every time someone dies, she becomes more powerful. Okay. Cool story game. I'm sure we do, Hope. This is a very long, empty corridor. Leading up to presumably death. Because this is how this game... Whoa. I got stuck back here while the door opened. Hmm. I don't trust you, game. I don't trust you one bit. This is the heart of Cocoon. Oh, it's incredible. Whoa. That's where Eden sits, controlling all of the other Cocoon Falci. It's also where we'll find Orphan, the battery that keeps Eden running. 
Good to know. So what's the plan? Your usual plan. Charge in through the front door. What else? <laughs> right, the front. Hey, hey what are you, where are you going? The front door. Pay attention. What is wrong? <laughs> Well, these people are prepared right. there, aren't they? Oh, right. That's a triggered fight. Oh, or not. I thought that was going to be scripted, but suddenly... Oh, this is going to go well. I hope that's our backup. Well, if it is, I don't think our backup is happy to see us. <laughs> Yay, backup! Except not really, that one's marching towards me. Okay, they stop. Is there anything behind that one? The camera would stop freaking out. The answer is no. So I have to kill this, because it's blocking the entire freaking path. I can't wait for the day where we can buy freaking aerosols. Well, let's do this fight again. That wasn't so bad the first time. Once you get your buffs up, it's not too bad. I probably should have set our default to Synergist, but whatever. So I can get bar fire and stuff up. Oh, he's already got all the... That was fast, jeez. And he'll probably steam clean before he does anything else, so I'm just gonna sit here and let Hope buff everyone. Slow has such a freaking massive effect on everything. Come on, Hope, you're the slowest man ever. He had fired us? Oh, it's weak to everything, apparently. Is it weak to stuff while it's steam cleaning? Because I don't recall it being weak to stuff when it's just sitting there. No, it's actually weak to stuff during that. That's interesting to know. I need a medic up. Don't worry. All right. huh? my lead. Just a quick medic and then get him slowed again. I need all the debuffs, man. All of them. Every debuff. That's close enough to every debuff for the time being. Yeah, people need to freaking Cura more often. All of the Cura. No, not Cura, Cura. Idiots. And then one more debuff when he gets out of this. Which is right now. And then this should be the last time we have to debuff. Yep, that's it. That's medic, that's not what I wanted. Although that worked really well. Murder its face! This should be easily stagger point. Because it's going to take them longer to steam clean than it will stagger, I think. In theory, anyway. Maybe not. Nope, he just barely got the steam clean off. Of course he did. And he doesn't have a 100% chance of launch. It's good to know. I really wish I had in peril on him before he was staggered, but alas, he got his steam cleaning off. So as it turns out, I am in fact mistaken about this will be the only time we need to stagger him, because the freaking steam clean. I was just a little bit too slow. I'm sad. I'm sad, Panda. The swagger gauge? Not quite. That's what I wanted was the smite. Do, 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 do. If you have two commandos, you can keep it 24-7 in the air. You can also keep it 24-7 in the air with three Ravagers. Interesting tidbit of information for you there. 
Please stop burning everyone. Thank you. Oh, it's got Imperil and D Shell. Got slow. There we go. That's good enough. Hopefully we can kill him this time. Probably not. Hopefully we can. Especially since he wasted time doing that. There he goes. Looking like he's gonna die. Good! That fight took about twice as long than it should've. 